When did you first find out that you wanted to be a comedian? I was always crazy in 19... And uh, uh, I was crazy on uh, one of my friends and parties and stuff like that. And I told stories with sounds and then I went to parties. I was the life of the party. And then finally a friend said, you got to come to Vancouver. There's a comedy club. What so was I your did. most embarrassing moment on stage? Oh, really? You want to know Yes, this? I do. It's gross. Absolutely. Okay. It's Bring gross. It. Seriously? Yeah. Oh man! This is the internet. We this, can put okay, anything. Okay, it's the internet. You can say anything. <laughs> okay, well, pop my cherry. Um, <laughs> I was, uh, I was, I was on stage, and uh, uh, I wasn't. It was my most. It was one of the worst, the worst moments on stage, right? So I'm on stage, and I, I do sound effects. So I put the mic in my mouth, and I make sounds and stuff like this. And the guy was on before me, and it was an old microphone with a sock on it. And I went and put my mouth on it. And it was covered in stuff. Oh. <laughs> and I, I re actually retched on stage. <laughs> so what are you, what are you most famous for? Uh, is it's it the Harley. Yeah, your Harley. My Harley Davidson bit. You know, it's uh, it's something I wrote right right in the beginning of my career, and it's and it's something that stuck with me. And everywhere I go, people go do the Harley. You know, and I get the weirdest requests in the weirdest places. You know, people come and go do the Harley, and I go no, now get out of my shower. You know, it's just <laughs> <laughs> you know, and it, and it's but I have people do that, and and it's just the way it is. It's the bit. Do not date online because if their face is this big in the picture or they're that big in the picture, something's wrong. I think the last time I was at the corral was like two years ago and I went yeah. in there, you know, and I'm looking to meet somebody in their 40s, you know, and I'm in there and I'm looking at, there's all these 20-year-old women and all the 30-year-old guys are looking at the 20-year-old women, you yeah. know, and then all the 40-year-old women are looking at the 30-year-old guys and at the end of the night all the 20-year-olds are gone and the 30-year-olds take the 40-year-olds home and I'm standing there going, this was fun. <laughs> Drinking that. <laughs> Pineapple. <laughs> You got tattoos. Oh, look at no, you go. It's, this is the, I swear that I was going to love it forever at 19 years old. And I oh, remind yeah. my children all the time, do not get a tattoo until you're at least 30. Because yeah. your 20s are for you to pretend to be an adult. And then your 30s are when you realize how stupid you actually are. And then your 40s, you get divorced. And then you. I've already been there. Yeah, me too. <laughs> you want to see the scars? <laughs> and this is Herb Dixon <laughs> with the first time with Christina. Yes. Christina Rossworm, Castanet see, News. See, Christina, <laughs> signing off. Thanks for coming out, folks. Castanet.net. <laughs>